guys, welcome back to my channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here, and today we have an unbagging. Now, this unbagging comes to us from no other than Amazon. Now, this is not diamond painting related. This is scratch art related. This is serious business. So, before we get started, I'm going to mute my computer so you don't have to keep hearing the dinging. Um, I wanted to order some tools to go with my scratch art kit because, you know, if I'm going to be doing this, I'm going to do it right. I'm going to get all the tools I need that are going to help me create these colorful, cool images. So let's get into it. Um, I didn't scratch out my address, which is why it's sitting that way. So I'm just going to try to, if you don't like the noise of the bag, mute your phone until you see me stop struggling with this bag. Cool? Cool. I can't even flip it the other way. Please don't let me cut into it. Yeah, I know I should have opened it before I started, but mind, stop minding my business. Find some business and mind it. It's my business. All right, so, get off my finger. What do we have here? Aha. Uh -huh. uh, um, get out of here. All right, so we have a toolkit and we have the landmarks. We'll get to that in a second. I know you're excited to see it. We'll get to that in a second. We're going to push that off to the side. So right now, this is the toolkit I ordered. And of course, I will link it down below for all those who have newly discovered scratch art or are interested in trying scratch art and think it might be something cool and fun for them to try. So you have your tools here. You have an etching tool, which, ooh, comes with a fine tip. Sorry, probably can't see that. Hold on, hold on, struggling, struggling. All right, so it comes with a fine tip for those fine lines. That's really what I was hoping that this was. Um, so you have the fine line tip there, and then you have the thicker tip here. Isn't that cool? That's so cool. And then you have this big toothpick thing for more lines. I was trying to get away from the wood, but, you know. And then you have this little etching tool, which I probably won't use. So, yeah, thank you for that. And then we have this. Now, this is for whenever you scratch the art and you get all the shavings, you just kind of brush it away. And I did have somebody ask me, where do, where, where do I brush my shavings? Onto the flow. Um, either I'll have, like, a napkin sitting beside me and brush it on there, or I'll more likely brush it onto the floor, and then I just vacuum the floor. It's just, it's, it's kind of like uh, the shavings from an eraser when you have a pencil. So, yeah, so I got this cool little makeup brush thing for that. And for those of you that were like, you could have just used a regular makeup brush. I could have, except for I don't you, I don't wear makeup, so I don't have makeup brushes. Yeah, you heard right. Don't gasp. Clear pearl clutchers beware. Uh, yeah, I don't wear makeup, so I don't own makeup and or makeup brushes. So, yeah. Um, I don't remember how much all this costs, but I'm going to clear some space for me to put it. Editing Leisha is going to put it like right here in this section here, put, put it there. There we go, right there. All right, so got my toolkit, pretty excited about that. Now, this is the landmarks. Now this book is actually a little bit smaller than the first book. The first book I got, which is Meditations book, that one, the cool one. So it's a little bit smaller, which means more possibilities for portability because being portable is a huge thing for me because I like doing these in the car. So let's open this up. Get, get out of here. Let's open this up and see what's in it. And I guess this is going to be our opening tool. <laughs> so how are you guys doing? Are you having a good day? I hope you're having a good day. We're just going to say you're having a good day. You're here with me, so you're having a good day. I'm having a good day. I get to hang out with you guys for a little while. Even though I don't get to see you, we still get to hang out for a little bit. So how you doing? All right, we're going to get this plastic off here. Wrap it up, folks. Wrap it up. That's how you protect everything. You wrap it up. Not like that. Get your mind out the gutter. Nasty. All right, get out of here, trash. So on the back, it says, take the meditative calm of coloring a step further with landmark scratch off nightscapes with the included stylus simply scratch the lines off 12 extraordinary images of famous landmarks from around the world and bring the beautiful multicolored backgrounds to life. 
the dramatic vistas created in the acclaimed Lago Design Studio in Seoul. Seoul, sorry, Seoul. Yep, it, look, look, I'm trying here, folks. I'm trying. Include the Chrysler Building, the Taj Mahal, Big Ben, and the Sydney Opera House. Ooh, interesting. After enjoying the soothing creative pleasures of finishing these stunning pictures, you can display them or give them as gifts. So that's awesome. And again, for this, I will put, I'll make sure editing Leisha put something like right, right here. There, there you go. Right there. There it is. That's how much I paid for it. But I ordered it a couple of days ago. And again, all that stuff will be right there. So this one, like the other one, let's see if it has the tool in the back. It has the toothpick tool in the back. And again, you just pick it up. Boop, toothpick tool. All right. So what, what do we have here? That looks like the place in uh, Seattle, actually. And I already scratched it. Good gravy. You got to be careful with these things. I wonder if you can scratch the side. Let's try to write my name. Yep, you can scratch the side of it. All right, so you got to be super careful with these. We're going to lay that down. So let's open it like it needs to be opened. So we're just going to take a look at a couple of the images here. Leaning Tower of Pisa. <laughs> Pizza. <laughs> Pizza. Now, I don't know what all these are. I'm going to say this is New York. And as you can see, there's quite a bit there to scratch off. So that's going to be interesting to see. Then you have the Eiffel Tower. Can you guys see that? You can see that. My nails are scratching it. Jeez, um. See what happens when I don't bite my nails? Ugh. I know, nail biting's a nasty habit. Red, I can, I can hear Red, one of my subscribers in my head. You don't want to know what she's saying. Anyways, you have the Taj Mahal. I'm actually surprised that I know what these are. Like, not that I'm dumb, but I'm not very worldly. There's Big Ben. But then again, it did say it on the back of the book what it was. Don't, shh, shh, shh. Let me have this. I don't know. <laughs> there you go, I don't know that one. Can you see it? Oh, no, flare, there, there we go. But that should be cool. The one time I get nails is when I decide to do scratch art and now I'm <laughs> scratching all the pages and that's Daisy boofing at the neighbors. Don't mind her. This, I want to say, is in China, or, or I'm going to say it's China. I, again, people, I don't know. So as I go through the images and I find out where they're from, I will give you little tidbits of information about each. And again, I scratch the page. Stop scratching the pages, Alicia. What are you doing with your life right now? All right, so we're just going to very carefully. Nice little carnival scene. And I'm definitely going to need that fine tool for these because these have a lot of intricate little lines. So I was very happy at the response uh, that I got for the scratch art. So Mindful Mondays will be, of course, on Mondays, which is why I'm calling it Mindful Mondays. Because after the rough weekend, you're going to need some mindfulness. I know what I do. All right, so we got some fireworks. And that's the Opera House in Sydney, Australia, I believe. Because, like, the little opera house is right here. Oh, of course, that doesn't scratch it, but my nails scratch it. Jeez, um. <sighs> I don't know where that's at. It gets dark here real quick, so, yeah. And then the last one, of course, is that place I think is in Seattle. So, yeah. Yeah. We got the landmarks, and as I told you guys before, those pages do come out, so you got to be careful. So that's the landmarks book from Amazon. Again, I will have all the information, again, right here for you. So editing, Leisha, just, just put it right there. I saved you a space. Just put it right there. Don't argue with me. Sorry. Sorry. Anyways, so that was my little unboxing for uh, my scratch art kit. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down in the comment section below. I would be happy to hear from you guys. If you need me, you can find me on my Facebook group, Crafters, I'm sorry, Crafters Anonymous with Miss Crochet and Coffee. Um, my next live will be Friday. So I hope to see you guys there. But in the meantime, I'm going to go scratch some art.
I'm so excited. Either way, guys, thanks so much for watching. This is a short one today, but you guys already had a live today. So like, seriously, really, don't be greedy. God, what do y'all want, my liver? Jeez, oh. Huh? Anyways, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down at this point. I don't give a crap. Either way, if you're not already a subscriber, please feel free to subscribe and hit that little bell to be notified anytime I decide to put up a random video. And believe me, it's random. And I actually said a closing today that I really, really like. So be kind, be courteous, be cool. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.